in case you forgot, said Mr. Lemoncello at the beginning of chapter 48. Extreme challenges are extremely challenging and sometimes extremely dangerous. Is Charles doing one, asked Akimi. He might. I'm going to ask him next. Mr. Lemoncello had changed out of his judge's costume into a cat burglar outfit. Pat black pants, black turtleneck, and sporty black beret. A beret is a French hat, if you didn't know. Is that costume a clue, said Haley? Because it goes with the whole bandit theme. Wait, what's a bandit again? A bad guy. A bad guy or a thief. Don't know, but Dr. Zinchenko has told me to wear it for the big finale. Is there going to be a finale? Wait a minute. Dr. Zinchenko told Mr. Lemoncello to wear the all-black outfit like a cat burglar or a thief. Does Mr. Lemoncello know the answer? Mm -mm. Oliver, does he know the answer? No. Who's the only person that knows Dr. how to solve this mystery? Dr. Zinchenko. Ian, who's the only person? That's right. Maybe with Charles, mumbled Kyle, we'll sort out. We'll sort of stuck. At least till 11, added Sierra. That's when the important clue will appear on the ceiling. Really? said Mr. Lemoncello. That Dr. Zinchenko, that woman knows suspense. Ooh, I love that word. Suspense is when you get excited about something and you build up to something. So let's do the extreme challenge, said Haley. What do we have to lose? Uh, the whole game, said Akimi. Not for all of us, said Kyle. I'll do the challenge. After all, I'm the team captain. You are, said Haley. We had an election, said Akimi, yesterday. Oh, cool. But Kyle, said Miguel, if you blow the extreme challenge, you lose, bro. I don't lose if my team wins. No, said Mr. Lemoncello. If you lose, Kyle, you lose. You're not allowed to share in the big prize. Ah, oh, I have to. Look, we know I'd be a fabulous spokesmodel for your games and stuff, but I just can't glom on everything Kyle and his team have already dug up. I have to earn my place on this team. Sorry, Haley. Extreme challenges are and always will be solo efforts, but... Mr. Lemoncello held up his hand. No buts. Kyle will face the challenge alone. However, yes, the rest of you can watch his progress on video screens. You can cheer him on on the intercom. You're a cheerleader, aren't you, Haley? Yep, said Kyle, but she never cheered for me. Well, I will this time. I promise, said Haley. Excellent, said Mr. Lemoncello. By the way, Kyle, there is no backing out once you commit to the challenge. Fine, said Kyle, let's do it. Go, Kyle, go, shouted Haley. Akimi flinched. Um, a warning next time, please. Sorry. Mr. Lemoncello touched his ear again. Here is your extreme challenge. Dr. Zinchenko tells me. Okay, so Mr. Lemoncello is getting the challenge. If you were Kyle, would you sign up for an extreme challenge no. knowing that you're going to get kicked out of the library if you lose? No. You would, Oliver? Because I know I would get it Ian, wrong. Ian, would you? I'd get it wrong. Ooh, you're afraid you'd get it wrong? And what's going to happen to Kyle? He's going he's gonna, he's gonna to lose. He's gone. You think he's going to lose and get it? And, no. and be gone? He's going to win. He's going to win. He's going to win. Gonna or you win. think he'll win this clue. Okay, here we go. The answer you seek, he paused to listen, the key to this code is a memory box that holds the mother load. What? Mr. Lemontello shrugged. Sorry, I don't write them. I only recite them. Wait, there's more. Forget the Industrial Revolution. My first idea is your certain solution. Does anybody know? The room was silent. Mr. Lemoncello touched his ear once more and continued. And now it's time for the addendum. Huh? A last minute addition. The box had been here, but now it is there. Poor Kyle, your fate is up in the air. Mr. Lemoncello stood there grinning for several seconds. 
Is that it? Said Kano. Yes. Find what you're looking for before the second floor doors open and it's yours. Fail and you, Kyle, will be eliminated from the game. And your team, due to, due to the series of these events, will be forced to struggle on without you. Good luck. You have 15 minutes. Wait a second, said Haley. Dude, you are so dead, said, McCamp, said Miguel. I think I know how to find what Mr. Lemoncello is talking about. You do, said Kyle. I better. I'm the one who moved it from here to there, said Haley.